Nation Women's Conference 2021. That's right. All right. Yeah. I always know, you know, women is the main one that always praise Jesus. Oh. Every time you turn around, women praising Jesus. Even when the men are out drinking up, smoking dope, doing everything else, oh. women at home praying for them. Yeah. 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 I'm just going to tell you like it is. Yeah, that's true. Yeah. And they said, tell the truth so you get in heaven. Lord knows I need all the truth. <laughs> all Amen. Right. All the truth I can come up with. But we're going to get started. Like they said, if ain't nobody here to praise them, we can praise them ourselves. Amen. That's right. Amen. I don't want to think about that. And she, she got out here, Brother Alvin. I told her, I'm deep in <laughs> But I love it anyway. <laughs> It ain't nothing she can do about it. <laughs> but anyway, we're going to start with a prayer by Minister Thornton. Yeah. Amen. You know your mama could have named you. Amen. 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 Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you. We thank you for our shepherd. We thank you for his family, Lord. Amen. Dear Lord, we thank you for, for just covering us this week, Lord. We thank you for everybody within the sound of my voice, dear Lord. Dear Lord, we thank you for, for just rocking us and keeping us in the night. Dear Lord, we thank you for keeping us and bringing us through the storms. Dear Lord, we just thank you, Lord. We thank you even for the little aches and pains, dear Lord, because we know that it could be worse. Dear Lord, we thank you for the roof that is above our heads, dear Lord. It may not be what we want it to be, dear Lord, but we are not homeless, dear Lord. Dear Lord, we thank you for the nourishment that you provide us, dear Lord, because as we walk around or drive around in our community, Lord, we see that there's homelessness here, Lord. I will keep repeating, there's homelessness here, Lord. And there's a thing that we need to do, dear Lord, and we ask that you lead us and you guide us in the direction to correct that problem, Lord. Dear Lord, I just say thank you, Lord. Thank you for touching my mind, Lord. I ask that you touch the mind of those that are here, Lord. I ask that you touch the vision of those that are here, Lord. I ask that you touch our lips, dear Lord, and that you guide the words that come from them, dear Lord. Anything that that resembles hatred, Lord. We ask that you remove it and rebuke it, Lord. Dear Lord, anything that is negative, Lord, we ask that you remove it, Lord. Dear Lord, this conference, Lord, we just asking you in advance for deliverance, Lord. Not only for the women here, dear Lord, for everyone, for every family that's attached to Stonewell Nation, Lord. For every family that's in our community, Lord. For every family that's in our nation, Lord. We just thank you, Lord. And we give you all the honor the glory and the praises. Dear Lord, and lastly, Lord, we ask that you guide our steps, Lord, that you lead us in the way that you will have us to go, dear Lord, and anything that's not like you, Lord, that you just remove it, Lord, because we want to be living witnesses for you, Lord. We want to be living examples and models for you, Lord. In the mighty and powerful name of Jesus, I do pray. Thank you, Lord, for everything. Amen. Amen. Thank you for that prayer. I like to went to sleep, but thank you for that prayer. <laughs> All right, we have a scripture by Tabitha Smith. Miss Smith. Yes, amen. Give her a hand. Give her a hand, nigga. Big old Bible. You ain't going to be here long. Hello, everyone. I'll be reading Psalms 100. Shout for joy to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him with joyful songs. Know that the Lord is God. It is he who made us, and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good and his love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through all generations. Amen. Amen. All right. 
Sing Psalm 150. Make a joyful noise. That's what we're going to make, a joyful noise. All right, we have a recognition of visitors by, and the welcome by Sister Victoria Worthy. on wheels every Sunday morning at 9 a.m. And on behalf of our pastor, Coleman Luke Stern, our first lady, Daphne Dooms, you are welcome, welcome, welcome. Amen. Amen. All right. Now we're going to get some singing for the praise team. Oh, 
You still can love somebody when you're going through something. Yes, God. That's pure love now. And we can't do nothing without. Yeah. Hallelujah. He give us a present every morning. Yes, God. We open our eyes. Yes, we got legs. Yes. We got a hand to clap with. And then we got a bond to say we love you, Jesus. Yes, God. That enough that clap right there for yourself. Yes. We ain't gonna worry about we ain't gonna worry about who him, he ain't them. We ain't gonna worry about what we going through. Yes, Just God. don't care. We love Jesus. Jesus gonna bring us out of anything. Anything that we in, Jesus will bring you out. You put your hand in Jesus' hand, he will bring you out. If you don't know the find that just said, Jesus, fix it. He'll do it. But you got to believe that he can do it. You can't sit up there and think he's gonna do it and, and, and then just walk off. But no, you got to believe. Because once you believe, that'll be twenty five dollars. I'm just like the preacher. That's why I can't be no preacher. You got to pray. You pay me for I preach. Then I know how long to preach. That's why I love Rev. Do Rev. Do. He went to the end. You can't eat that. <laughs> All right. Now we got no prizes. We got no prizes. Jesus. Well, door prizes, I'm sorry, door prizes. <laughs> we all country, we got door prizes.
get to three. All right. All right. All right. We got anybody here from the Exceeding Grateful Ministry? All right. And we ain't got no solos. So I'm going to call the pray team back up. Come on back up, pray, pray team. But, but before we do that, though, we go. Y'all, this is, uh, anybody in here been skydiving? I did I did so. No, we black. We don't do that. Okay. But we need to pray for them people out there because this guy hurt his leg the other day. But what they didn't know, the guy stuttered. The man told him, said, look, count to 10 and then pull your shoe. So him and the partner jumped out the plane. And he just came on past the partner. The partner pulled his shoe, count to 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 9, 10, pulled his shoe. The other man passed by the partner and he hurt his leg. They took him to the hospital. It was on the news. And they asked the partner, said, what happened to him? So well, when he passed me, he said, So don't skydivers. <laughs> All right, Praise Team, come on, give me two songs, please. Oh, yeah.
and get ready for the offering. Y'all bring it on. Bring on the offering. See, you got the PPP loan. <laughs> yes, sir. Fill that offering bucket out like you felt out that PPP loan. Come on, ticket lady. You must see the killing us out here. Look at that little fan, just fan. They like that yellow man. I'm glad I'm a dog. 21? 65. 21? 21, 65. All right. Okay. Uh -huh. <laughs> the last one, 21. 
21? 74. 74. Yeah, I got it. Yeah. All right. She said, thank you all for, those, for your participation on the dope prize. All right, we're getting ready for some more music. And I'm gonna need, I'm gonna, I'm gonna need this music here, because I tell you, I was talking to a young lady the other day, I said, you know what, y'all women just be wandy dog on wig like my grandma. She said, yeah, but y'all men don't pay bills like granddad. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, I need these other week. <laughs> All right. Introduction of Refresh going to be by Evangelist Shalom Bentley. The Refresh Choir was established in 2016 under the leadership of Pastor Coleman Dumas III, Stonewell Worship Center, Water for Life Ministry, previously located at 59 Rock Hill School Road, Thomaston, Georgia. During that time, the choir was under the direction of Lakevious Lions and on many occasions, Refresh would travel to numerous churches accommodating our pastor as he preached God's holy word in neighboring cities and even out of state. As God's blessings upon the stone well continued to flourish, Refresh increased in its membership as God opened the doors to our current location, 204 Park Lane. Due to a nation nationwide pandemic, the choir was no longer able to worship within the confines of brick and mortar. But nonetheless, nonetheless. it never stopped our praise. Right. Refresh continued to lift up the name of the Lord through songs of praise, worship, hope, and inspiration. The Bible says that Refresh is to restore strength and animation to revive, to freshen up, right. to renovate, yeah. to restore, right. and to maintain by renewing supply. All and that it. is yeah. our mission here at Stonewell, to win souls for Christ yeah. through song. 
Refresh is currently under the direction of Sherry Wilder with a dynamically anointed group of musicians using their gifts to praise the giver. Even though the choir is few in number, I said even though the choir is few in number, God's grace and his mercy towards Refresh is more powerful than ever before. And to him, we give all the glory.
Give us a refresh out. Oh, yeah. Amen. Amen. God bless you all. Have a good evening. Amen. 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 